I was to describe Flavors of Home in three words, fabulous, amazing, and Lord of Mercy. Flavors of Home, for me, is about inspirational food. It should be about food and memories that inspires you. I think food is tied to, intrinsically tied to our, you know, home life and our childhood because that's the kind of stuff that we grew up on. I think food is perhaps one of the most inspiring things for us when we grew up. The food that reminds me of my childhood, you know, the, the dish is Jamaica's national dish. It's called ackee and saltfish, and it was what my grandmother would have cooked. A really simple dish. Most of the ingredients for ackee and saltfish we grew in our garden. Chocolates and, you know, sweets and stuff like that. But I think of late, the older you get is the more you think about your body as opposed to your head. Hot or not for me? Well, Lord of mercy, come on! It can only be one thing, hot baby. You know, for me, it's, it's about the heat, it's about the capsicum, it's about the way you feel, it's the way how it changes the food. I don't put it in everything, but if I'm cooking as a demonstratory food and, you know, and if it's a savory meal and it's allspice, I've got to have the allspice berries, you know, and I don't use the powders either. At home because it will resonate with what we are, you know, talking about, you know. Perhaps you will recall your own flavors of your own home, and after you've listened to us, you can get up and go into that kitchen, you know, and to revive those flavors. So there is a reason why we're doing this. It's not just about us. It's to also to let the listener, for them to tap into their own flavors of their own homes. <laughs>